Yeah. You can't be a couple months ago and then hold Islam up in the air. You may, you you disrespecting Islam. Mm. Oh, no. Maybe I should be a super villain. In today's video, Corey Holcomb shares his thoughts on Brittany Renner, whom he believes is mocking Islam. Corey is skeptical that she could have gone from engaging in questionable behavior just a few months ago to now being converted to Islam. He feels that someone needs to be on the straight path for at least five years before he can take them seriously. Brittany Renner, the one that was like talking stuff to women, talking about, hey, you can, you should go ahead and get knocked up by an athlete because they're dumb and that you can get their money. Remember homegirl? The worst people to deal with are the athletes. None of them use condoms, really. So if y'all really want to try to come up off a check off a man, I mean, you could just f an athlete. They're really dumb. <laughs> Okay, and she was recently actually just on, she appeared on Club Shay Shay. She was on that uh, podcast. Anyway, she is claiming that she's um, converting to, converted to Islam. Oh, she lied. And she... We got to call Riz on that one. Do you know this <laughs> Riz? So... Hey, Riz don't know you. Most people... <laughs> Look went at her eyebrow. On, most people went on her live. That was her live. She did a live with the red um, hajib on. And she said... Um, Can you have a BBL and be a part of the nation? Wait, didn't her, wait. Didn't her friends say... Not only that, but wait. What, why, why is she saying... So now she's even... I'm like, wait. If you did fully convert to Islam... It's almost like she's mocking it because she's over there claiming, oh, this is, I wonder how this is going to interfere with my other um, ventures. In other words, I can't, I can't wear the, the Fashion Nova stuff to promote their photos anymore. I mean, wait, what? So she can't be serious, but she claims but she is. Didn't her dude just take custody of their kids you because never see he her with said kid. she was in a That's the same one, is it? I don't know. I mean, somebody go tap that on the shoulder, right? So, yeah, she's causing a lot of stir. Somebody going to be like, hey, 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 hey. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Yeah. Stop it. Just cut it out. <laughs> Stop, yeah. playing Choked out the mosh, yeah. Stop playing with her. Stop playing with her. Yeah. Somebody going to tap that. Hey, 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 hey. Enough of that. <laughs> Don't be playing. Don't play with that. <laughs> hey, we ain't so playing. This ain't no joke, duh. Even, is she even went as far as to say on that live right there, she was like, I need to get, um, Botox shots under my arms because I'm so sweating underneath this. So, anyway, yeah. Where you get that picture from, eh? What is that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. Oh wait, though. You know, just like it hasn't even been a full she year. She converted to Twizzlam. Wait, and she, It hasn't even been a full year, and she was on this <laughs> podcast. I don't know the name of the podcast, but it was what's his name? That that wild, crazy guy. That might white guy. What's his last name? White. The one that be talking crazy. Charleston White? Yes, and she was grinding on him. She wasn't just grinding on Charleston White. She also threw water in his face and in one of the co-hosts' faces. She was acting like a complete lunatic. Oh, goodness. Wait a minute. I didn't do nothing for that. Oh, oh, that's... Oh, 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 Miss Miss Renner, Miss... She was acting childish. And this video with Shahrazad Ali perfectly sums up her behavior. The average black woman in America don't get no older than about 14. So just talk to her and deal with her like you're dealing with a 14-year-old. Don't come at her like you're dealing with an equal because she's not going to be able to accept that. You got to go way back. And uh, we cut off at about 14 or 15. We don't develop and mature no further until we get some new information and accept some different information. She looked like she was inebriated. She was on something. and she was That was like, about a year ago, right? Yeah, but now she's full. Okay. Anyway. Hey man, look, like, okay, it was a year ago. Let's say this really did change her life, which I, you don't, you can't change your life in a year, not in the public eye. It take at least five years without the shit before you step to the world as somebody who's be taken seriously. You gotta be at least five years into trying to be a stand up person. You can't be doing this on the grinding last year and this year everybody i'm on i'm 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 a, I'm a muslim yeah. i give her about six months before she's back in the streets yeah. like and how, that's a crazy dog and and how is it that your your social media still it's, has your revealing pictures what it say <laughs> no oh more throat 
That is comedy. That's Tupac's lyric. And oh. you ain't even with it. Got a big money scheme. She makes fasting a whole nother word. Wow. Oh, look at her. That's that podcast. Oh, my God. How embarrassing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What an awful raggedy b- and why wouldn't you? Why Who wouldn't got you the nerve out? to come out and disrespect yeah. Islam? Yeah, that's and try to hold it in the air, knowing you ain't even putting no work in. No. Like I'm saying, like a from five years ago, a from ten years ago, mm. you can be like, oh, okay, let's see, she trying to do something different now. Yeah. But a from goddamn ten days, right? Uh, and let's just stop playing with this. She no. was on Club Shay Shay saying what? And how long ago was that? That wasn't a year ago. No, Man. that sure wasn't. It's like, stop disrespecting the game of life and take something publicity. seriously. How you can go that far for publicity? That's crazy. Talking about, I need, talking about she's manifesting a new wardrobe. And you know what this means, Nayel. She said, inshallah. Oh, no. I may say. Sure. Inshallah. In- what does that mean? God willing. Yeah, it means if it's the will of God. There you go. Islam comes after all else fails, so you know what I mean? It just seems too fresh. That's mm. all. Uh, you know, occupational find redemption every day, but, you know what I'm saying, she needs to give it more time, let it marinate. Just she like can. I said, yep. you can't be a couple months ago and then hold Islam up in the air. You, may, you you disrespecting Islam. Mm. If I'm trying to get my life together, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go and go to college. Right. Not college, like real college. Mm. I'm going to go put work in to trying to be a better person. So when I step to the world and I do claim something, there is time that can back up. I'm not living that lifestyle no more. Sure, because people have done it. There's people that have done that. Of course. I know people who have put real effort into changing their life. Their life and their And it shows. Yeah, yeah. Like that, though, you don't sit your phone. But wait, to have your whole social media still like that. In other words, if you were serious, it would have been like, boop, deleted. That's gone. That ain't me no more. You know, but you still got it up. And No, you delete your whole social media. Right. Because if you're trying to do what's right, you don't need it. Right. What's on social media that a person who's trying to do right needs? Let me tell you something about my accounts. I skim through them. It's frozen, guys. I skim through my accounts. I don't like to do shit on my account, though. What do you mean skim through? What do you What do you mean? I look at the pictures and people. I don't. Most of the time, I don't even have a sound on. Yeah, well, that's what it's I like to look at the pictures right. and people and things like that. But I can't communicate on that. Sh- like mm-hmm. that for real mm-hmm. 